Bruce Grau, take two. I wanted to speak to you about my life experiences and how it's led me to join the Poor People's Campaign. As a kid, I was never wanting. All of us, all us four boys and even our parents graduated from the University of Wisconsin. Now, I graduated with debt, but not, not the amount anywhere near the astronomical figures that we're seeing today for our kids. My father ran our uh, family named business, which he had um, was handed down to him from his father. It was a home building company called Grau Builders. But at the, about the time that we were leaving for college, my mom was starting to get really sick. Medical costs were piling up for my dad and her. The home, home market, starting to crash while his wife was dying so was his business just he, he was teetering on bankruptcy luckily he was able to get loaned out of that uh, my mom did eventually pass away and following that experience my dad went out and immediately bought two supplemental health care plans in addition to medicare and the one that really provided him the most benefit, ironically, uh, but luckily, was through the Carpenters Union. As a kid, I was sick a lot. I was hospitalized a lot due to uh, complications from asthma. And I think that experience led to me choosing the medical, the health career, uh, as a health career in the medical field as a, as a career. And my experience in uh, practicing as a, a nurse and then a geriatric nurse practitioner was predominantly with marginalized populations. I started uh, working for elderly indigent people in the hospital of um, Indianapolis, Indianapolis's indigent hospital. Uh, at the time it was called Wisher. And then primarily just uh, elderly people. With this experience, I really was able to see the struggles and dehumanizing effects that losing one's ability to function and finance their lives. Uh, the struggle to remain independent. failed and what kind of negative and dehumanizing effects that had on, on my clients. They had to rely on others and they hated having to rely, especially on their kids. They had to rely on the system and eventually an unfortunate majority of the people that I work with became to rely completely on the system to meet all of its needs. I've seen how facilities and hospitals have minimized the support that's needed to meet the physical and emotional needs of older people, especially. How they skimped at creating any kind of a home-like environment relying on the old institutional approach. All for the sake of the bottom line. I'm hoping that by joining the Poor People's Campaign, we can create a system of healthcare that is dignified and puts the people, people's needs over profits. I'm convinced the approach that the Poor People's Campaign takes, this moral fusion matched with direct action will help us create such, such, a, more, such a dignified and humane system. Thank you.